Hello everyone. Welcome to Mr. Ophidian's new video. Today we are going to know about the most deadliest snakes in the world. 10 of the deadliest snakes in our world. An encounter with one of these reptiles could cost you your life. They hiss, they slither, and unfortunately for humans and unsuspecting prey, they bite. Snakes bite about 5.4 million people every year, resulting in between 81,000 and 138,000 deaths, according to the World Health Organization. Venomous snakes kill their victims with toxic substances produced in a modified salivary gland that the animal then injects into prey using their fangs. Such venom has evolved over millions of years to cause severe reactions in the victim, from immobilization and hemorrhage to tissue death and inflammation. Here are 10 snakes whose venom not only packs a punch for small prey but that can take out humans. Black Mamba Africa's deadliest snake, the black mamba can kill a person with just two drops of venom, Live Science reported. Named for the dark, inky color inside of their mouths, black mambas are actually brownish in color. They average around 8 feet in length, and can move at 19 kilometers per hour. The lengthy snakes are born with two to three drops of venom in each fang, so they are lethal biters right from the get-go. By adulthood, they can store up to 20 drops in each of their fangs. Without treatment, a bite from this African snake is just about always lethal. Once injected, the venom interferes with activity at a junction where nerves and muscles connect, resulting in paralysis. Because the venom is also cardiotoxic, it can lead to cardiac arrest. Scientists aren't sure how many people are killed every year by black mambas, but estimates it is responsible for the largest number of snake-related deaths in southern Africa. Fertilance A bite from a fertilance can turn a person's body tissue black as it begins to die. These pit vipers, which live in Central and South America and are between 3.9 and 8.2 long and weigh up to 6 kilograms, are responsible for about half of all snake bite venom poisonings in Central America. Because fertilance venom contains an anticoagulant, a substance that hinders blood clotting, a bite from this snake can cause a person to hemorrhage. And if that didn't scare you off, consider this, a female can give birth to 90 fierce offspring. Boom slang. The boom slang which can be found throughout Africa but lives primarily in Swaziland, Botswana, Namibia, Mozambique, and Zimbabwe, is one of the most venomous of the so-called rear-fanged snakes. Such snakes can fold their fangs back into their mouths when not in use. As in other deadly snakes, this one has hematoxic venom that causes their victims to bleed out internally and externally. With an egg-shaped head, oversized eyes, and a bright green patterned body, the boom slang is quite the looker. When threatened, the snake will inflate its neck to twice its size and expose a brightly colored flap of skin between its scales. Death from a boom slang bite can be gruesome. As victims suffer extensive muscle and brain hemorrhaging, and on top of that, blood will start seeping out of every possible exit, including the gums and nostrils, and even the tiniest of cuts. Blood will also start passing through the body via the victim's stools, urine, saliva, and vomit until they die. Luckily, there is antivenom for the boom slang if a victim can get it in time. Eastern Tiger Snake Native to the mountains and grasslands of Southeast Australia, the Eastern Tiger Snake is named for the yellow and black bands on its body, though not all populations sport that pattern. Its potent venom can cause poisoning in humans in just 15 minutes after a bite and is responsible for at least one death a year on average. Russell's Viper Around 58,000 deaths in India are attributed to snake bites every year, and the Russell's Viper is responsible for the majority of these mortalities. This species is considered one of the most deadly of the true vipers. This nocturnal viper likes to rest in paddy fields, they cause high mortality among paddy farmers during harvest time. The snake's venom can lead to an awful smorgasbord of symptoms, acute kidney failure, severe bleeding, and multi-organ damage. Some components of the venom related to coagulation can also lead to acute strokes, and in rare cases, 
symptoms similar to Sheehan's syndrome in which the pituitary gland stops producing certain hormones. Victims typically die from renal failure. Saw Scaled Viper The Saw Scaled Viper is the smallest member of the Big Four in India along with Russell's Viper, the common crite and the Indian Cobra thought to be responsible for the most bites and related deaths in the country. Rather than the stereotypical hissing sound attributed to snakes, this viper starts sizzling by rubbing together special serrated scales when threatened. Once bitten by this viper, a person will have localized swelling and pain in the area, followed by potential hemorrhage. Since the venom messes with a person's ability to clot blood, it can lead to internal bleeding and ultimately acute kidney failure. Hydration and antivenom, there are nine types of antivenom for this snake, should be administered within hours of the bite for a person to survive. Banded Crite The banded crite is a slow mover during the day and is much more likely to bite after dark. The snake's venom can paralyze muscles and prevent the diaphragm from moving. This stops air from entering the lungs, effectively resulting in suffocation. King Cobra The King Cobra is the world's longest venomous snake, measuring up to 18 feet. The snake's impressive eyesight allows it to spot a moving person from nearly 100 m away. When threatened, a king cobra will use special ribs and muscles in its neck to flare out its hood or the skin around its head, these snakes can also lift their heads off the ground about a third of their body length. Its claim to fame is not so much the potency of its venom, but rather the amount injected into victims, each bite delivers about 7 milliliters of venom, and the snake tends to attack with three or four bites in quick succession. Even a single bite can kill a human in 15 minutes and an adult elephant in just a few hours. Coastal Taipan You could be bitten multiple times before becoming aware of the coastal taipan, thanks to its incredible speed. When threatened, this snake, which lives in the wet forests of temperate and tropical coastal regions, will lift its whole body off the ground as it jumps fangs first with extraordinary precision and injects venom into its enemy. Before 1956, when an effective antivenom was produced, this snake's bite was nearly always fatal. Inland Taipan The Inland Taipan is one of the most venomous snakes, meaning just a teensy bit of its venom can kill prey, or human victims. They live tucked away in the clay crevices of Queensland and South Australia's floodplains, often within the pre-dug burrows of other animals. Living in more remote locations than the coastal Taipan, the inland Taipan rarely comes into contact with humans. When the Taipan does feel threatened, the snake coils its body into a tight S-shape before darting out in one quick bite or multiple bites. A main ingredient of this venom, which sets it apart from other species, is the hyaluronidase enzyme. This enzyme increases the absorption rate of the toxins throughout the victim's body.